Hello fellow Sudokans and welcome to Zen and the Art of the Guardian Sudoku Puzzle. It's Thursday the 3rd of October 2024. I hope you are feeling well and I hope you had a good night's sleep. Uh, I had a fitful sleep actually. <laughs> I, had to woke, I woke up several times. Uh, but I'm awake now. I suppose fully awake I guess. Although I haven't had breakfast or done anything much. Um, so I shall uh, attempt to play the Guardian's hard level Sudoku puzzle in just a moment. If you are a person who believes in human rights, you may be quite buoyed and pleased by the headline uh, uh, that um, uh, the president of Georgia, uh, of course I'm talking about the country, not the US state, uh, has refused to sign anti-LGBTQ bill into law. Uh, but it's only the headline that you'll be happy about because if you actually read the story, uh, uh, she has uh, refused to sign the bill and sent it back, uh, not vetoed it, and the bill is probably going to be signed into law by the Parliament's Speaker, the Georgian Parliament Speaker, so it will pass uh, anyway, just delayed by a bit, it seems. Uh, this law is a kind of copy of the Russian legislation which 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 has echoes of uh, Mar one of Margaret Thatcher's policies back in the 80s, a kind of anti-promotion bill uh, of uh, gay rights and things like that. It's uh, very discriminatory. And uh, not only that, the country of Georgia is suffering um, increased violence, anti-gay violence. And uh, one um, transgender actor who is well known apparently uh, was found stabbed to death uh, immediately after the bill was passed in Parliament. Uh, so, temporary good news, but unfortunately it's a long uh, fight there for human rights, as it is in many countries around the world. Alright, let's get on with the game of Sudoku, shall we? Um, where to begin? Oh yeah, let's start with the threes blocking across here like this. Oops, it does help if you hold down the right key. There we are. There's a three. Three blocking up here, three blocking across here. And there's another three. Six blocks this way and down here. So we've got three and six together. So we're going to get three and six up there later, for sure. Uh five blocks up here so I'll put five into this square and leave us with a four here eight and nine block this square puts eight and nine into the bottom row there and gives us enough room for a four So let's see what's left up here. Uh, what are we looking for? Mm, five and... Oh, actually there's an eight there. Look, I said, I'm, I said I'm fully awake, but I'm not sure that I am. Eight goes there, nine is there. <laughs> That's a five and eight up here. And we've got the eight blocking across there. So there's the eight and there's the five. Clearly I'm not fully awake. I take it back. Maybe I should have had breakfast and had a shower first. Never mind. I contend that you don't need to be fully awake to play the Guardian's Sudoku puzzles, really. They're not that difficult. We have eight blocking across here and across there and up there. Eight blocking this square, this square and this square. So in that row, here's an eight. Five and six are over here. That's going to put five and six over there, isn't it? And leave us with a one here. Oh, I hear the distant rumbling, deep rumbling of thunder. Uh, the cat's got to go to the hospital today. And I've got various things I have to be doing today. So let's uh, hope it's not too serious a storm. Six blocks like this, that will give us a six there, and the five finishes that row. I 
I think we're missing 2, 4 and 7 oh, in this row, aren't we? 2, 4, 7. And 7 and 4 attack this square here, so that's got to be a 2. Uh, so what's left here? 4, 8, 9. Okay. And this is 4 and 7, as I just said. So this is uh, 1, 2, 3, is it? So 2 and 3 there, so that's our 1. One blocking down here. Oh no, I got it wrong. I missed it. Got it wrong. One and five blocking down here, actually, though. One and five blocking down here. So that's a pair of one and five in those squares. And we've got five blocking this square here. So that's going to be our five. And that's going to be our one. And what are we left with? Uh, is it four, seven again? I think it is four and seven, yeah. Uh, now, can we do more with this one up here? And down here, this should be the last digit one, I think. Oh, deep thunder again. What's the time? Oh, I've got an hour and a quarter before the cat has to go out to the hospital, so. If you're going to rain, rain now. Or don't rain. <laughs> uh, what else is going on here? I wonder if we should go through in sequential order or if that doesn't... No, we don't need to. Two blocking down here and two across there. There's our two, then two across this way. This way and down there will give us two in that square. And two up, two up here and two across there says that you must be a two and two across here and back that way and up there does not finish the twos ah oh, there's another one here i was going to say finishes but it doesn't that definitely finishes the twos now uh, this is a three isn't it we had four and seven in those squares and that's a three So we have three blocking this square, this square, three blocking this square, three blocking this square. So in that row, there's our three. Six blocking up here and up here for a six there. Seven blocking up here for a seven there and nine finishes that section. Nine blocks across here and up here, so nine in one of these two squares, whichever one is, I don't know, but nine across there, nine back up there, that's our nine. Remind me, what are we looking for here? Four, eight, nine, is it? I think it is. Uh, four, eight, no, they're in not minus eight places yet. Uh, let's see, what do we still need to do? Threes, okay, fours, what do we need? What do we need? Fives we can get. tucked out of the way now eight blocks this square here we need eight in this column it goes there we finish this column with a nine come back over here and finish this row with uh, seven I think it is and seven blocks across there for a seven here and the last number two places is a four and the missing number here is 9. So 9 going up here, up here, and across there. And also 9 blocking down here for an 
the final digit nine. The missing number here is four. Four down there, there's the four. Missing number here, eight, I think. Uh, all right, well, have we got any places where there are only one digit missing? Let's see what we need. We need three. Can we finish the threes as is? Maybe not. We need four. Can we finish the fours as they lay right now? Uh, I'm not sure. Six we still need. Six is block up here and up there. So there's a six. Six this way, that way, and up there. Six is finished. How about the seven? Seven blocks up here and across there. There's a seven. Seven blocks across here. There's a seven. I don't know if the microphone is picking up this thunder, but it's kind of ominous sounding. It's really deep. It's quite a long way away, I think. So we might escape it yet. I might get lucky. Missing digit here is a four. Four also blocks up there, putting a four in that square. And four blocks across here for a four there. We just need digit three to finish now. That's it. The Guardian's hard level puzzle for a Thursday over and out. I should be able to play other games today. Uh, it's a relatively free day to me. It's not completely free, but it's my less least hectic day of the week. So I'll see you around. Bye bye.